Peace comes from a changed attitude. When you see humans as fundamentally selfish and whole nations as fundamentally evil, then all you have available to change their behavior is threats and bribes. Peace comes from a different place. The charter course for the future of our nation's military and foreign policy all return once again to the words of John F. Kennedy. He said, America's weapons are not provocative. They are carefully controlled. They are designed to deter and capable of selective use. Our military forces are committed to peace and disciplined in self-restraint. Our diplomats are instructed to avoid unnecessary irritants and purely rhetorical hostility. But the danger of reckless escalation and nuclear brinksmanship is real and present. I therefore call on our present leadership to adopt President Kennedy's maxims and to start de-escalating right now. I call on every American to join in a new peace movement, to make your voices heard, to reject the insanity of escalation, and to celebrate no longer the wartime president, but a president who keeps the peace.